You're right, I should have boiled the water first. No, it tastes, it tastes good. So what do you mean by what you said before? Think about it, Stacy. That's all I've been thinking about since you said it. All I said was that it's going to be a little different once things settle down. I heard you. But you make it sound like our life together is some kind of jail sentence. The way we've been living is kind of like an adventure. You know, there's all this mystery and danger and whatnot. Oh, and you think I just thrive on that, right? I didn't say that. You like it. No. It's just that what we've been doing is kind of like something out of a book. Now, what happens when all that ends? More books. Better books, more romantic books. Think about it, Stacy. You've got this law practice and you handle very important cases. And there I am doing construction. Look, I've told you a thousand times before. I know. Just let me I, go I on, know okay? what you're going to say. Well, then there's this place. What about this place? Well, sooner or later, they're going to kick me out of here. And then you're going to want to find some nice legal apartment and sign a lease. And, you know, I don't know. Oh, and that'd be terrible, wouldn't it? <sighs> I don't know. I've never had a, a lease. It'll have more than stay. one burner. I like my life, Stacy. Okay. So we'll stick with one burner. I'm not trying to change you. Promise. Okay, let me see your appointment book. Why? Just trust me. Come on. Yeah, what are you going to look for? All right. Okay, look, this is next week. You have lunch with the deputy mayor on Monday. Tuesday, you've got a planner for some charity ball. Mm -hmm. Okay, Wednesday, you've got a squash Those turning. are things that I have to do. I'm not going to apologize for them. Well, how do I fit into all this? Well, you don't have to. Well, I think I'd better try. Why? Because... Okay, look at this. Dinner party. Bar association dinner. Mm -hmm. I'll go to that. Oh, you, you, don't, you don't have to do that. Why not? Would you be ashamed of me or something? Luke, come on. There's, let's sit down. No, there's no time. You look awful. Yeah, like back on Gold Street. Yeah, when you used to have a fight. Yeah. And this is hard to explain. Does this have to do with Catherine's death? Part of it, yeah. The police suspect you, don't they? They will. But I swear to God, I didn't do I it. I know that. I believe you. You're the only one who will. Listen, why don't you have a drink? Let me just Fanny, get my... no. What? We have to talk about Mitch. Why is all this stuff on it? I guess that was their idea of disguising. Who? The people that were after you? It's Lucas. What? I followed Lucas down here. I caught him with the swan. Lucas? Yeah, he said he didn't steal it. You don't believe that, do you? <laughs> no, he's been lying since he first showed up. Can't prove it, though. How did you get it from him? I took it from him after a bit of a tussle. He did that to you?
What's going on, Rick? I need a big favor from you, Zach. See, um... I love weddings. Well, you should, Cecile. You've had enough of them. Ugh, what happened to the incurable romantic I used to know and love? I got cured of you. Totally. Go ahead. Make fun. Who's making fun? All along. All I was doing was looking for Mr. Wright. But silly me. Here he was, right under my nose. Uh, I'm sorry to interrupt, but it's urgent, Cass. What's the matter? Uh, I just phoned the office, and that client you've been wooing for months... Well, he called, and he wants you to get back with him tonight. Mr. Washburn, old money bags himself? One and the same. Great, thanks, Zach. Okay. All right, go get him. Uh, how long does this meeting last? Well, I got a feeling Cass is going to be tied up for quite a while. Maybe I should have rented some movies. Huh? For tonight? To watch? Unless, of course, you want to go out. No. Well, then maybe we could spend time with Allie Sam, and have... I don't want to do anything until I find out what's going on with Mom. Grandma, thank God. Where have you been? A bit of the paradise, working. Where else? You went to paradise after the shower? I work for a living, old buddy. Remember? Well, did Mom go with you? Uh, no. She was on her way home to pack for a trip. Well, where is she, then? Isn't she here? Would I ask you where she was if she, if she were here? Hey, wait a minute. Don't smart mouth me. Ada, what time did you and Rachel leave the party? Oh, about two hours ago. Everybody was charging over to Evans to crash John's bachelor party. Rachel and I passed on it. Where did she go then? What, didn't she call? No, not at all. Nothing. Evan had to leave for New York without her. Oh, I don't get it. She was anxious to leave that party so she could get home to pack. Wait a minute, I have an idea. What? What? She might be with Mitch. What'd she be doing with Mitch? He called before and left a message I completely forgot. Hi, Felicia. This is Amanda. Hi, honey. Uh, I was wondering if either you or Mitch had seen my mother? Yes, actually, I, I saw her at the shower. No, I mean after, after she left. No, as far as I know, she went home. What about Mitch? Uh, I don't know. I haven't seen him. Is he supposed to be home? He was actually supposed to be over at John's bachelor party. I called over there, but he hadn't arrived yet. Um, Felicia, could it be possible? What? Do you think maybe the two of them could be together? I don't know. I, I suppose it's possible. OK, I'll call you if I hear anything from her. Thanks. Okay, and uh, I'll... Uh, I'll call you if I hear anything. Bye-bye. Believe it. What did she say? Mitch is missing, too. So? So obviously they're together somewhere. Why is that so obvious? She, everything that she said. Wait a what minute she now. Say? Wait a minute, you guys. Now relax. Look, Amanda, my brother is happily married. He's not trying to get cozy with your mother. I don't have time to argue with you. Where are you going? I have to catch the 10 o'clock flight to LaGuardia. Obviously, Mother has other things on her mind. Now, wait a minute. That's my daughter you're talking yeah, about. you said you weren't going to New York. I don't have a choice. Hey, come back. this up okay great 
Oh, you're right, it is cold in here. There, fantastic. Like to shiver by. Okay, just a minute, I'll help you with that. There, hang on to those. Great. Oh, not so bad when you have light. Well, we're gonna be all right. No, it's all right. It's all right, the kids out around you. Somebody will find us eventually. We have each other. Body heat. You found the red swan for me. We'll be all right. Everything will be all right now.